Hi there guys, welcome back. In this video, you're going to learn how to detect moving parts and also how to measure the speed of a moving part. In this example, here you can see I have a part and it's staying still, so nothing is happening. But if it's moving, if I go and move it and it's moving, it's going to explode. Let's take a look. You see now it's moving and it's going to explode. Let's now go to studio and learn how to detect a moving part. Here we are inside Roblox Studio, and here is our part. Our part has a script. On the first line here, we're declaring our part, and we're declaring the threshold, how fast the part has to move in order for us to consider the part is moving. So our threshold is 0.1. You can use any number there you like. Here we have a while loop to check when our part is moving. So basically, when the velocity of the part is equal to or higher than the threshold, then the part is considered moving. As long as the velocity is less than the threshold, we're going to keep on waiting for 0.1 of a second and check again. So we're going to keep on checking every 0.1 of a second until it breaks the threshold. Then we're going to move to this part here. In this section here, we're going to change the color of the part make the color flickers between red and white and then we're going to create an explosion to destroy the part. Let's play test again and take a look. I'm going to go to my part and right now it's not moving so nothing is happening but as long as I touch it it's moving and it's gonna explode. And there it goes. Now, on the other hand, if you want to allow the part to move slightly without blowing it up, you can change the threshold. Instead of 0.1, you can change it to 5. So now the part is allowed to move slightly. As long as it does not move too fast, it should be fine. But if its velocity is faster than 5, then we're going to blow it up. Let's take a look. I'm going to go to my part. And this time, I just want to move it slightly, but not too, not too much, not too fast. So there, you see it's moving slightly, but it's still okay until I go and move it really fast. And now it's going to blow up. Guys, that is how you detect a moving part. And also, that is how you measure a part's speed. Thank you all for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and we will see you in the next video. Take care everyone.